get to these days i have to go out with at least 400 now to get there and uh, i'm not even talking about going and coming back i'm just talking about going alone so it's so expensive in a day you're spending close to 2000 naira on just transportation alone Hey guys, welcome to the channel. The name is Godwin Kinshiku, and on this platform, I share walkthrough and point of view video of my city, Owerri, Imo State, in Nigeria. And in today's video, I want to share with you what has been going on in the city of Owerri. And I think I'll do this more often where we get to like talk. As I just sharing the point of view and walkthrough video we get to like share an update with you guys on what has been going on in the city so that we will keep ourselves informed so that's it i want to talk about today are just two stuff or two topics the first one i want to talk about is just the increase in the price of fuel and how it has affected a lot of things in the city down and what do i mean by a lot of things one i want to talk about something that affects everyone and that is transportation transportation has gotten so expensive in Oweri at the moment the places i paid 150 to get to these days i have to go out with at least 400 naira to get there and uh, i'm not even talking about going and coming back i'm just talking about going alone so it's so expensive in a day you're spending close to 2000 naira on just transportation alone because of the and this because of the increase in the price of fuel and this has immensely affected a lot of people you know and funny enough it's not like the income or the money you make at the end of the month sustain you or sustain your transportation talk more of feeding talk more of other things uh, talk more of levies you have to pay here and there increase in the price of fuel has affected a lot of things in fact the last time i went out that should be on thursday um i was out and i was just observing and i found out that a lot of people have packed their cars at home but people do not go out with their cars anymore because of this so the roads is scanty no traffic and all that everywhere is so free so i don't just know i don't just know i think our leaders need to do something about this they need to do something about this increase in fuel it's crazy imagine fuel increasing from 150 to 200 to 300 and now to 900 and even 1000 so it's just so crazy and secondly what i want to talk about is just the increase in crime rate in over something else a lot of a lot of people get robbed every day especially in so many spots in the world which i'm going to talk about namely warehouse emmanuel college junction Cherubin junction mbc road and so many other places um i i am not so sure of but these places i just mentioned now are places where i heard people talk about or people who had experience of being harassed or robbed in these places so i would say one of the factors that has contributed to this is just the recent economic hardship and the, the recent hardship in the country so a lot of people are looking for means to survive i'm not trying to justify that so many people have gone into crime just to survive mm, it is not justifiable though so we just have to be very careful if you live in this time you have to be very very careful careful of these spots i just mentioned and please whatever will make you stay late at night in some places you know where you try to avoid it because most of these guys they get to do this when uh, they find people in lonely spots and i forgot to even talk about the bank road uh the the where the dog the junction in bank road that leads to douglas yeah in front of um just after garden park was it garden park that uh basement that is still under construction that place is dangerous so we have to be very very careful of those places in Oweri. so that will these are the things i want to share with you guys and from now on i'm gonna come and make videos like this 
uh, more often where we get to like talk about things that affect us as residents and you know share updates with, with, with you guys on what has been going on in the city of Owen. So please, if you're seeing this video for the first time, subscribe to the channel and if you really enjoyed this video, let me know in the comment section and if you want me to talk about something else, also let me know in the comment section. It's to your guy, IK. Have a wonderful day.